Hello and welcome back. Today we're going to create a simple tune in Scratch using its sound blocks. So I'm going to go into Sound and I have Play Note here. And if I drag out Play Note for 0.5 beats, that's for half a beat, and double click, I get a simple note. What I'm going to do is create a line of music. So I can either click on the rubber stamp tool to duplicate or I can right click and choose duplicate that way. Well, if I start off with 60 and click the down arrow, this brings up a piano keyboard and you can see that 60 is middle C. My next note is going to be D, 62, followed by an E note, 64. and back to 60. And double clicking on that stack, it plays the first line of Frere Jacques. And we can see that a computer program carries out the instructions one after another in sequence. Now to create the next line, I can simply duplicate these and place them below. And that's fine, but there's a shortcut we can take, and as computer programmers, we should always be looking to make our life easier. So I'm going to get rid of these bottom four blocks, and I'm going to drag out a repeat control block. So I can either drag it out and drop the four blocks inside it, or I can wrap the repeat block around those four blocks. And I'm going to repeat that twice. That doesn't mean that it plays the notes once, and then repeats it another two times. It means that it carries out those four blocks twice. And we can see at the bottom of the repeat block a little arrow which shows that it goes down the blocks, back up, down the blocks, back up. So it repeats that two times. And this is what programmers call a loop. Now moving on to the next line, this is Dormez-vous, because poor Jacques has overslept. And this last one is a G, 67. Let's repeat that twice. Hmm, that's not quite right. And that's because that last note lasts twice as long, and that should be one full beat. That's better and put these together and play them together. OK, so we're going to build up the rest of the notes and play the tune at the end. Well, I've now finished all the different parts to Frere Jacques. Let's see the third and fourth parts. Note, of course, that I'm down to a quarter of a beat here, half a beat here, and a full beat here. And you'll probably end up experimenting a bit to get this and other tunes right. Now, before I finish, I'm going to put all of these together. Put a When Green Flag Clicked hat on top, and I'm going to click the green flag to play my tune. Oh, and one last thing, you can also change your instrument. And of course, before you finish, remember to give your project a name. Have fun!